Hi everyone and welcome. In this video, we are going to create an NFS data store. I'm already connected remotely into my management workstation and I have a session open into my vSphere infrastructure. We can see the list of data stores that we already have, which are all VMFS. Going to right click on the data store and under storage, select new data store. This is going to be NFS rather than VMFS. Click next. It's going to be version 4.1. We have to name the data store. We have to provide the path to the folder that is shared on the server. In this case, the folder itself is going to be that is shared is the one that we're going to access. And then we need to specify the server to look for. That is pointing at our Windows server. We can select whether or not we want to mount as read only, which we do not in this case. Next, we are not going to use Kerberos authentication. Click next. Host accessibility is going to tell us which ESXi hosts are going to be able to access this data store. In our case, we want both. I'll select the top checkbox, which will take the two. Next and finish. That will go through and create our new data store. Here is our NFS data store here. And we can now use that to store virtual machines on rather than using VMFS. So if we're looking for something that is file IO versus block IO, that is the way we would do that. So wrap for the video. Hopefully this has been helpful for you and we'll see you next time.